we're back with Courage My Love. Woo! <laughs> It definitely works acoustically. I think it was a good, it was, that was a good choice for you guys to do the acoustic album, you know, the different Thanks. versions. It's awesome. Thank you. Um, tell us a little bit about Japan. Tell us what's going on with Japan. Uh, uh, well, we signed um, a record deal with uh, a Japanese label called Spin Records. And we were so stoked because it's every band's dream. So we were really excited. And because we love sushi so flippin' much, <laughs> like, it's the best thing ever. So uh, we can't wait to go over to Japan and just gorge ourselves with sushi. Um, but yeah, we're putting out a full length in Japan, and it's only available in Japan. It's got a couple new songs on it that Pretty aren't much, gonna be available here. Yeah, it was just some songs that didn't end up being on, like, our, our EP in Canada for now. And I guess in Japan, they don't really make EPs, no. I guess. I don't know. So we had to make <laughs> it a bit longer than it was, so we just added some extra songs. Yeah. And so I guess they're not really new. They're old, but not heard yet. Not heard, yeah. So yeah, yeah. new. <laughs> well, that's considered new to everybody else. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Okay, okay. Very cool. So yeah, do you know what? Are you, are you planning to go? When are you? Yeah. yeah. Like, w um, it's in the works? The CD is coming out there on July 18th. So... We probably won't be able to get there that soon, but we're already, you know, with our a our agent and stuff, figuring out plans and how we get to go there and stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm so excited. I, like, you know, I want to slap myself and make sure it's r real. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of sushi. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, so my now I, again, I'm gonna I'll I'll give props to questions that I that I overlap because I haven't looked at them. Okay. Uh, maybe I should, but I think it's spontaneous. It's good not to look. So. I wanted to know a little bit about what your writing process is like when you guys get together. Who who does like does do you have certain roles? Somebody does more of one thing than the other, or you know, do you fight that kind of thing? Tell me. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> um, mostly how it works is Says and I will write the songs. She'll write the music, and then I'll write the lyrics. And it's cool because that's how it worked on for now. But recently, we've been kind of trying to do it where we both. She, she collabs on some lyrics, I collab on some music. And David's, David, you know, just kind of... I'm, I'm kind of the referee. Yeah. If, <laughs> if they try and write at practice and they get in a fight, it's my job to yeah. tell them that they're both right, but right. that I like one better than the other somehow. It's really hard to do. Because we get along so well, like Phoenix and I are the best, but then it's when we're writing, it turns out that arguing yeah. is our writing path. process. Yeah. So, so we argue, and then we make up, and then we have a song. <laughs> Anchors, the video was actually inspired by trying to write an album. Wait, wait it was inspired by what? what was that? Try, trying to write for now kind of inspired <laughs> Anchors. Uh, but we're actually like the best team, I think, because uh, we can both be honest with each other. You know, like if we don't like an idea, it's like, you know, there's no kind of like, uh, it's good, you know. Yeah, it's I think like, we don't really worry about hurting each other's feelings. And that yeah. sounds bad, but it's actually good. We're actually, it's actually oh, yeah. I appreciate that way more than being like, no, it's awesome. That's so good. You know what I mean? Yeah, so. that's, a, well, that's, that's a good way to go into the writing process, I mm -hmm. think. It, much better to be able to tell somebody that. It's not working for you or yeah. something like yeah. that. You're gonna get you're gonna get the best out of each other. And then it, I think it becomes a better song too because you know if you're writing something, you might get too attached to it and you don't really see that it you know it doesn't work. And yeah. then you know you'll tell me if it doesn't work or I'll tell you if it's not working. And like especially with lyrics and stuff like that, I hear them coming across a certain way and then I'll be like, oh Phoenix, check this out. And then she'll be like, it sounds like you're being really angry and mean. <laughs> blah blah blah. <laughs> like, okay, <laughs> we just like rewrite it. So yeah, it works out in the end. It's good. 